All right, so we're gonna install or drive on this. All right, so let's take all the plastics, especially for the breathing because it needs it. All right, so to open it, all you gotta do is slide it out, all right? I actually removed the screws because this goes, uh, you, you're supposed to leave them there. So let me put them back. Uh, that was my mistake, but I make it so you guys won't. The thermal, all right? It's gonna be the metal that's gonna cool it off, but you, you have to have this thermal. They give you the actual thermal tapes, all right, in here. So we're gonna mount this in here, and they give you the screws. And if you don't want a screw, they actually give you the rubber ends. These are I like these better because they they're easy to remove and add them. So we're gonna go ahead and add one. They give you two here, so which I like, and they have different sizes. Uh, I believe this is a sixty millimeters, I believe, or eighty, eighty. I think that's what I forgot. So put in your drive, all right. Lock it in place. Uh, there, lock it in place. Now, because we have the thermal, we're gonna put some thermal tapes in here and we could put them all. I will say put them all, you know. There goes. There's one. Get them all closer. I wish there was one tape only. I don't know why they did this. I guess because different sizes, I guess. And this is going to go over it, so you don't have to worry about it. So slide it. I think that's it. I like the cable. It's a little small cable, but um, it's optional. I said they give you an extent, uh, another one, type C to type A. All right. And of course, extra, in case you lose the, or you're going to replace the NVNE, you could. Here's with this case. So let's go and plug it in. All right, the only reason I got it for was because I like to take my phone with me a lot and transfer some of the stuff over to it. So this is also compatible with a Droid, all right? Uh, iPhone, you might not because of the format that you have to do, but on the Droid, you can transfer stuff. And you can see a lot of information in here. So right now we have about 555 gigs left. And then um, time... Runtime, it says 11, and then the battery is getting out of the actual system itself, 100%. Some of the details are a little le unlegible, so I can't see. I'm blind as a bat. And then the heat source, which is 26 Celsius. And then um, USB, uh, 5.31 volts. That's what it says. So 27, it heat, it's starting to heat up a little bit. But not too much. I mean, you can see the circuits, the circuits on here. I like this stuff. And all right, on my phone because I have a Droid. All right, I'm gonna go into the folder, my files. All right, and because this thing has internal and external, and you can see internal, I have 512 gigs. USB, I have a one terabyte. It tells you right here, and you can, it's legible. As you can see it in here. So I'm gonna go into the USB, and you can see all the folders that I have currently have in there. So we're gonna do a transfer of a drive to the system, right? So we're gonna plug in a USB here. We're gonna transfer some files over to our system. All right, we're gonna transfer a five gigs, five ten, and it's transferring right right now. It's about sixteen megabytes per second. 600 so it jumps up it fluctuates but it's gonna take about five minutes to transfer from the system so it's not bad and um, I'm doing it from a type C to type A all right but if type C to type C it would be a lot faster right now the system only could handle certain things so not bad transferring rates picking up it fluctuates we saw the 600 now it's at 38 39 so it's gonna be faster than three minutes actually so not bad 99.6 of you are not subscribers in my channel. I hope that the content helps you out and that you find it very useful. And I hope you hit the like and subscribe.